You know those newsletters you swear you're going to read and then never do? What if they read themselves to you as a natural conversation while you're cooking, commuting, or walking the dog? Today, I'm going to show you how I built an automation that turns any newsletter into a dynamic back and forth between two AI voices and delivers it to your inbox as an MP3 using N8N, GPT-40 Mini, and 11 Labs. And the cool part? You're not limited to newsletters. You can use this exact workflow to turn any text into a podcast-style conversation in the Notebook LM style. Perfect for blog posts, reports, or even your own written notes. Stick around because I'll show you the setup step by step. And hey, if you're impatient like me, you can skip straight to the good stuff. The full N8N workflow is linked for free in the description below. If you want to support the channel, please consider using my 11 Labs affiliate link down there as well. It won't cost you a cent extra, but it helps me keep creating free content like this. And while you're down there, don't forget to like this video, subscribe, and follow me on Twitter for more automation tips. Before we dive into the steps, here's a quick example of what's possible. I've been using this exact workflow to create a podcast based on the official N8N blog. You'll find the link in the description. Let me play you 10 seconds so you can hear the result. Using AI. So Chris, what exactly is AI sentiment analysis? At its core, AI sentiment analysis uses artificial intelligence, specifically natural language processing and machine learning to determine the emotional tone behind it. Here's the quick tour before we jump in. First, we grab your unread newsletters from Gmail. Then OpenAI Node turns them into a two-person chat. We chop that script into speaker turns, loop through each line, figure out who's talking, and send it to the right 11 Labs voice. Next, we render the audio, stitch all the clips into one clean MP3, tidy up the leftovers, and boom email the final track straight to your inbox. All right, let's break it down step by step. We start with the Gmail trigger node. This is set to check my inbox every minute for newsletters from a specific sender. You can filter by from.newsletter at domain.com or subject your weekly update, whatever matches your source. If you're building this into a bigger app, Swap Gmail for a webhook so your users can send content directly. Next, the magic, the generate dialogue script node. I'm using GPT-40 Mini to rewrite the newsletter as a conversation between voice one, curious, expressive, casual, and voice two, analytical, calm, with a touch of irony. You can absolutely refine your own prompt to get the tone you want. Just remember, the important part is that the output keeps the same structure with those two voice labels. That's because later, we're going to split the script based on that format, so we can send each part separately to 11 Labs. The result is one long, natural-sounding dialogue with realistic pauses. And I like to make it at least 10,000 characters, so it feels like a full, immersive podcast episode. Then, we split the dialogue into bite-sized chunks, one for each speaker turn. This is key because Eleven Labs needs one clean text input per voice to sound natural. Now we loop through each chunk. The if node checks who's speaking, voice one or voice two, and sends the text to the matching Eleven Labs voice. This is where you can play around with 11 Labs parameters and voice options until you find two voices that really match well together. If it's your first time using 11 Labs, please use the link in the description to register. It supports my work and won't cost you a cent extra. And if you'd like me to make a short tutorial on how to set up and use the 11 Labs API, let me know in the comments. I'll be happy to create one. Once all chunks are voiced, 
we stitch them together. We generate a concat list ext file and use ffmpeg to merge the mp3s without re-encoding, so there's no quality loss. Just keep in mind, this part only works if you're running n8n locally or on a self-hosted server where you can install ffmpeg. If you're on n8n cloud, you'll need an alternative merge method since you can't run ffpegm commands there. Bonus, the workflow also deletes all the temporary audio files afterwards to keep things tidy. Finally, we attach the final merged MP3 to an email and send it right to your inbox. You could easily swap this for Slack, Telegram, or Google Drive if you prefer. And that's it, your newsletters. Now a personal audio show you can listen to anywhere. You can grab this exact N8N template from the link below. And if you want to try 11 Labs, using my affiliate link helps support free tutorials like this one. It won't cost you a cent extra. If you build on this workflow, maybe adding Spotify uploads or turning it into an AI-driven podcast, tag me, I'd love to see it. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like, subscribe to the channel, and follow me on Twitter for more automations and AI tips. Thanks for watching and see you in the next automation.